Hello, my name is Linda Newman Perez and I am a life coach. Have you been feeling discouraged lately, down, going through tough times, don't really know where to reach out, don't know how to get help, and maybe even feeling a little suicidal? Well, today I want to talk about ways to cope. I found a wonderful list of 84 different ways to cope and today we're going to tackle number one, which is ask for help, reach out to someone else. If you don't really know how to reach out, we can make it a simple process. Number one, grab a piece of paper uh, and a pen and write down the names of the people that you know and trust that you would feel good talking to about whatever your situation is. There's a good way to test whether these people are right for you or not. Um, if you talk to them and you say, you know, I'm kind of having a bad day and they say, oh, that's great. See ya. They're not the person to talk to. But if they say, hey, what's going on? Then and then you would be able to talk to them about your deeper stuff. So test it out. Feel whether they're safe to talk to or not safe to talk to. Now, if you don't have anybody you can get a professional, you can contact a therapist. A good way to do that is to call your insurance company and grab that same pen and pencil and write down, they usually give you about three different people that uh, your insurance covers. So you can talk to them that way. Uh, if you don't have any insurance, a lot of therapists have this thing called a sliding scale where you pay based on your income. So if you have absolutely no money, then you would pay like 30 bucks instead of like 200 bucks. Uh, to talk to a therapist. So that's also possible. Um, if that doesn't help and you're feeling really down and really out, you don't want to live anymore, you've contemplated suicide, you don't want to go through any more pain than you're already going through, there's a fabulous number called 1-800-SUICIDE. 1-800-SUICIDE. And they can talk to you and they can talk to you and help you get through the really, really difficult time that you're in and hopefully help you set some goals for you to be safe and okay. Um, one of those steps might be going to a hospital. If you need a hospital, don't be ashamed, do it. Totally do it. It could totally change your life. It could help you get grounding for what's wrong in your life. It could help you get some medication, which helps a lot, a lot and um, you're able to kind of work through whatever it is that, that's going on and kind of get to the other side of it uh, and feel safe while you're doing so. So that's a really good thing to do. And then if you truly can't talk to any of your friends or family and you can't figure out a therapist and 1-800-SUICIDE doesn't work or a hospital doesn't work, feel free to give me a call. Again, my name is Linda and my phone number is 949 Six four eight one nine six six, and I will help you get some help. So that's it for today. Again, if you have a tough time that you're going through, reach out, ask for help, and reach out to someone else. All right. Thank you so much. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. God bless you, and have a fabulous, 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 fabulous day.